Hi guys, I hope you're all well. I decided that I was gonna film a video because I've just come back from the Radio 1's big weekend in Norwich. So I don't know if any of you know, but I actually went to university in Norwich. I went to the University of East Anglia and I graduated two years ago and I never ever thought that Radio 1's big weekend would ever go to Norwich. I was so lucky to go because I didn't even apply for tickets. My friend Jess, who I went to school with, she applied for tickets and she managed to get tickets for both days and I was absolutely amazed. I automatically assumed that all the tickets would be gone within literally a few minutes, so I didn't even bother. But she was so amazing and she fought through and got both tickets. As soon as I saw the lineup, I was obviously over the moon. There were so many incredible artists and I honestly feel so fortunate to have been there, especially considering BBC put the whole thing on for free. I was lucky enough to also stay with friends in Norwich and it just made the situation so much easier because we could drive up from Cambridge to Norwich on the Saturday morning and then drove back at the end of the shows on Sunday evening. I've got to say that Taylor Swift was hands down my favourite person out of the whole weekend. She was absolutely incredible and she really, really got the crowds going. After that, I think it was David Guetta. I think third up was Rudimental. They were absolutely amazing. It's the second time that I've seen them perform and they were absolutely incredible. Whilst I was there, I picked up one of these lanyards for the Saturday. Um, I didn't actually realise that this was only for the Saturday because most people only had tickets for one day. So I didn't actually buy one on the day after, but I kind of knew what was happening anyway. I knew that on the second day, every single person there was somebody that I wanted to see. So if I was at the main stage the whole day, I was pretty much guaranteed to see everyone that was going to be really good. As you will see in the title of this video, I saw someone who I was so excited to see. I was sat down on the Saturday having some lunch at the back of one of the shows and Jim Chapman walked past and he had a hat on and I don't think anyone else in the crowd recognised who he was and he had his sisters with him, I think, I couldn't properly see, but I literally squilled with excitement and ran from where I was sat to him and asked if I could have a picture with him and to talk to him. Now, as I'm sure you're all aware, Jim Chapman is a YouTuber and he is the fiance of Tanya Burr, who I'm sure you've all heard of. He was so polite and so sweet and of course he said yes to having a picture with me and I was absolutely over the moon. I was so happy and I ran back to my friend and had a massive grin on my face for literally the rest of the day after seeing him. So here is my picture with Jim Chapman. I hope he had a really, really great time. I actually did see him later that day walking past with Tanya and I thought, Do you know what, one selfie is probably enough. So I hope you had a really good time, Jim, and it was really nice to see you on the main stage the next day introducing one of the acts. So I'm going to get on with the video now and I'm just going to show you some of the clips from over the weekend. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys, and I hope you enjoy these clips. See you in my next video. Bye!